Uh, tonight we're going to be reviewing Everdell cards for those of you who um, haven't played before and we're, so we're going to do a quick rundown of what all the cards look like and do. So the first thing we're going to talk about is a critter and a construction. This is the critter, this is the construction. For critters, they have berries. So to buy them into your city, you have to pay berries. And up at the top, you'll see a, um, a word. And that word, word will be the name of a construction. This one says lookout. Um, and then if you play, if you build that construction into your city, you can play this critter for free. If you place the lookout in your city. The next one is a construction. It'll have um, materials that you have to pay to get it into your city. And it'll have a symbol of the critter that you can play for free. So this one's a mole because it's the mine. And the critter you can get is the minor mole. You can play that for free if you have this in your city. <clears throat> then the next two, uh, we're gonna talk about unique and common. So as you can see, this is a common, this is a unique. A common, you can have as many as you want in your city. So I can have as many teachers as I want in my city. And yeah, it will say common right here. Common critter or unique critter, this is a common. The next is a shopkeeper. This is a unique critter. It says right here. So I can only have one in my city. Only one. And um, so these are points that help you win the game. So if you play this card in your city, you get two points. If you play this one, it's one point. And there are also different types of cards, as you can see here at each one. So, um, for the seedling, this the seedling means um, you get the bonus as soon as you play it, but there are also certain cards and certain times when you can get it again. Um, this one, you can. This one, you only get the bonus once, as soon as you play it. That's the only time you get it. This one, the flower, um, it gives you, it gives you these points, but it also gives you points for things you have in your city at the end of the game. Um, the bear paws, these ones you have to have a worker placed on the card in order for them to give you the bonus. And the last one, the scroll, um, these ones, they give you something every single time you play something or do something. So as an example, um, this one, you draw one card after you play any critter or construction. So that's the breakdown of the Everdell cards. So keep playing and have fun.